Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to show you step by step how you can easily add an icon to your button in Webflow. It's nothing difficult and it's pretty easy. So the first thing that we have to have is we need to download a Font Awesome 6. So write it on Google Font Awesome 6 download and you're going to click on the first link and you will get it right here. So when we're going to be here, what we have to do is that we're going to do it uh, free for web and right now it's being downloaded okay show all downloads and here it is so now we'll just open it Okay, and now I'll just find it. And here I have it. So what we're going to do is that we have to... Click on web fonts. So right here. And we're going to have the web fonts here that we're going to upload to our web flow we're gonna do it only because then we can use the icons so here i go to site settings now i go to fonts and when you're gonna be in font what you're gonna do is we're gonna upload a custom font and when we go to font awesome again Here we're gonna upload the FA Brands 400 Wolf 2 Wolf Wolf and then Solid Wolf Wolf. So when you're gonna have it, upload file. and upload file okay and now when we have both fonts what we're gonna do is that we also want to change the font weight to 900 and when we got it save what we're going to do is that we're going to go to Font Awesome icons. And when we're going to be in, let's say, icons, we're going to go free. And let's say I want to choose the play. So I'm going to copy down the top right. You can always change it to whatever icon you want. So like this one here, copy. And now when you got it, what we're going to do is that I'm just going to paste it right here. And as you can see, it's just like this, this square or something. And what we're going to do is then you just have to change the font to your custom one. But I'll just refresh the page. To have the font on so now I will just add a font and wait a second I just need to refresh it and look at this FI solid 900 And that's how it's done. Of course, what you can do, another thing is that you can uh, copy it. So you would copy the HTML. And then you can just add it also as a HTML to your Webflow. But this is how we're going to just add a button. So thank you very much, guys, for watching. I hope this video helped you. And have a great day. And goodbye.